Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Final Fantasy 12. We're here in front of the hunt board because it's hunt time. Let's do it. Okay, so we got an automos. I have no idea what the hell this is. We could probably try to do... I mean, we just defeated the Desert Moose last episode. So that means we could do level 5 quests. or well, level 5 hunts here, but... Probably better to go in order. Let's just go in order. So an automos. I don't know what this is. Let's find out. Oh, we've totally fought these guys before. Yeah, I mean, Slavin. In Albina Fortress. Have we actually... I know, like, at the very beginning of the game, we were at Albina Fortress. Can we actually go there, though? Because that wasn't Vaughn. That was... That was Vaughn's brother. Okay. Well, we must be able to get there. Burrow is apparently the petitioner. Colossal Slavin Wilder, Rampages in the Mountains. They say the Alcadian army roused it somehow, but it's our problem now. Sure, we'll go speak to the petitioner. What the hell? Okay. Well, apparently we can go there. Okay, so it's in the middle of the... It's apparently on the bridge. There is a teleport stone. But I think maybe we need to actually make our way there ourselves. Apparently we can head to the Esther Sand and head up that way. Okay, we gotta look at another... Let me look at the map. Okay, so yeah, we take... The... Well, we want to go that way anyway, right? According to the quest, we need to get all the way up to Arcades. So, we need to get there somehow. Okay, so we take the Esther Sand and somehow we get to Nalbina Fortress. I'm guessing just head, like, north somehow. Okay. Sure. I mean, it's technically on the way we want to go. We can check out the teleport stone and just see if we can teleport there. Though I have, like, what, six stones right now? Not very many. Five stones. Right, because we we had seven that we teleported both times from the jungle. Yeah, okay. That's a problem. Let's just take a nice little walk. What could possibly go wrong? Nice little pleasant walk through the Esther Sand. Um, take a moogling here. And we will go to the east. Go east, young man. Okay. Um, we should save because we got the quest. I'm probably saving too much, but that's just how it goes. Alright. So, east. Go. It should be fairly quick. I doubt we're going to get much in the way of XP on this trip. We actually know... Let's see. Oh, yeah, there we go. Now being a fortress. We know exactly where it is. Okay. Okay. I don't remember going this way before, but I guess I must have. Maybe there's a cartographer I can talk to. It seems like most of this stuff is not actually fully explored. Where's that go? Where does that go? Hold on. Where's this? That's like straight up north. How is that not going to Albino Fortress? Where's that go? That goes to the. Probably the Barham Passage? I don't know. I mean, it doesn't matter. We're not going that way anyway, but it's still weird. Alright. They guys don't bother us. We won't bother them. This guy's totally gonna bother us. Oh, well, one hit KO. Okay, that's gonna be dead simple then. We're going to be fine. And this is a level 3 quest, so this should be totally... Yeah, we're just going to murder some dogs, apparently. I need to go... Okay, so north, but this obviously isn't it. The wolves here. Whatever. Or hyenas, or whatever the hell these things are. Okay, what about the Saurian? We don't know. Uh, cast Libra on yourself here. There we go. And then... Oh, he's 34. He's weak to air, though. I think we can take him out. I think we can take him. I mean, his name isn't red or anything. I think we can take him. Oh, he's not actually... He's eating the wolves. Okay, so if he's weak to air... Let's use air. 
Uh, what the hell is air? Blind, aqua, sleep, arrow. There we go. I ain't in like that. Oh, wow, yeah, he just drops. So much for that Saurian. Uh, is there a village over that way? Apparently so. Okay, wolves, no problems. Dude, you guys weren't even... Yeah, you guys are no problems at all. All right. There was a village down there. I must have gone this way before. I don't remember this at all. Uh, there's got to be like a shop or something, maybe? You guys should shop? Hello. And actually, do one last thing for me. The cactus flower. We take that to my wife for me. She's in the village north. Oh, that's right. The side quest. The village north of here. And a sick traveler found near the village. Think she might be able to burst some medicine from that flower. Village on the south bank of the Nebra. Tell them to send someone to relieve me while you're there. The village north of here. Okay, that's gotta be where... That's gotta be where that goes. That's gotta be where that teleport stone is. Yeah, okay. Um, it's a little out of our way, but it's a side quest. They're not gonna tell us... Yeah. The thing is, they don't keep track of the side quests for us, right? We just gotta do that ourselves. And the only way for me to do that, like on a personal level, is to do it immediately. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go just straight up north. We're gonna ignore Nalbino Fortress for now. We're gonna ignore our hunt and do this stupid flower thing. Huh. What I call Valentine's Day is a super stupid flower thing? That's not true. I mean, it seems like it should be true, but it's not true. Okay, we wanna go this way. Yeah. Oh, come on, guys. Just one hit KOs? You gonna give me any kind of challenge here at all? Huh. Answer there is no. <laughs> Answer there is dead no. Are we even getting any LP for this? We're getting XP. Surprisingly, I don't think we should be actually. Probably not going to be. Any, I guess a minimum of one XP per bad guy is probably not a horrible idea. I don't know. It all comes down to game balance. Like how you decide these things are actually like worth it. The thing uh. is, you don't want to encourage too much grinding. But Final Fantasy games kind of are all about the grind a little bit. <laughs> I mean, that's why you have the hunts is so that you can have something to kind of something to work towards while you're grinding down the levels, right? Okay, I'm gonna go just straight up north here. You can get distracted by dogs if you like, but it's not really gonna matter. Uh, did I miss? Oh, there we go. It's on this side. But you just need a little bit of something to do, right? That's the same idea that goes behind like most MMOs. It's yeah, you're hunting ten boar asses or whatever, and of course not every boar has an ass for some reason. But that's because your main goal really is just to try to grind as much as possible. Okay, so this must be the village here. Have we ever we must have been here. Okay, so I want to talk to his wife. You look like you could be a very old lady, your village elder, so probably not his wife. Uh, could you be his wife? The thing is, his wife is probably named. Probably not just going to be random villager number three. It's probably like, her name's like Barbara or something. I don't know. Villager, villager, villager. That might be all we get, though. It might just be villager, villager, villager. Okay, so let's just talk to random people. Hello. My husband's even gone to the North Bank for three days and not heard word from him. Would it kill him to send a message? Hey, apparently not you. I mean, who am I to guess? Maybe it's this guy. You a wife? Our village drowned us in the river Nebra. We offer desert travelers pastures to cross, but for a small fee. The ferries cross to the North Shore. I worry it's too long come. There's little for us to do but wait. Probably another side quest right there. Find out what happened to the ferry. Errol and Nalith. Nalithal? I can't pronounce that name. Nadal? Nadal? Nathal? My, my tongue will not make those words. Just, it will not make those sounds. Could not be true of friends. That wolf is like a brother to him that run around playing from dawn to dusk. Well, he's probably the only one who can pronounce the damn wolf's name. Quiet. We've got a sick traveler sleeping just inside. Collapse not far from the village. I worry it may be already be too late. Oh, hey, you must be the lady of who needs a flower. Andre obeyed you, bring this cactus flower. This should help. Yes, thank you. This, take this for your trouble. 
Got a bundle of needles. Why, what? <laughs> Why do I need a bundle of needles? What the hell's a bundle of needles gonna do for me? Bundle of 1,000 needles. Frustrated merchants and impatient buyers arguing over the precise sense of counter needles and given bundles of common market site. Addict in the making, right? Why do I need a bundle of needles? I mean, there is... Isn't there a... Huh, actually, hold on. Isn't there a... About the area, what a gambit called a thousand needles? Or not a gambit, a, a license? That sounds really familiar. I don't remember if it was a Shikari or Bushy skill. There it is. Okay. Huh. Maybe I need to, like, turn this into somebody? Possibility. Or it's just vendor crash. I mean, it could be just funny vendor crash. That's possible, too. I will find out, but this is awfully suspicious. Okay, while I'm here, I might as well go ahead and do the, um... What am gonna do here? Because I don't see gambit slot and what I want. Is it over That's right, it's over here because he has the crap HP right now. Yeah, so there you go. Get better HP, buddy. Thank you. Okay, but that's awfully suspicious, right? It's like we got a thousand needles, and there's a skill called a thousand needles. So maybe that's my chocobo just over there. It's a fondness for shiny things. Buries everything it can use as a beacon. The most recent victim, all the gill I made at Robin Ostrich. Down on my luck, you might say. Why someone help me out? What'd you say? Okay, what do you got? You've got onion shot. Big deal. Eye potion, which I guess I could buy some more of, but I don't really need. And blizzard. So no techniques from you. Can I do a vendor trash here? Here, here's, here's a Loxley bow. I don't need this. And... I don't know. Um... I don't know if anybody can throw bombs. I could sell the Thousand Needles. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. I think we need this. You know what? I'm going to look it up. Because it's just... It's damn suspicious. It's damn fucking suspicious. Okay. Going to look this up here. So, Final Fantasy... I got to specify 12, of course. Because it's going to be different for every game. Final Fantasy 12, um, 1,000 needles. Location. Okay, there we go. Maybe there's actually something special we need to do here. And sure enough, there's a game guide. Of course, it might like tad like 4,000 things. Nope, there we go. It just says 1,000 needles can be found in Soshin Cave Palace Falls of Time, which I have not been to. But I don't know what that is. That's it. That's all it tells me. That's all it says. <laughs> One sentence. One sentence. It's found in the Soshin Cave Palace. That's it. That's all you got. That's all I can say. Okay, well, thanks. Appreciate that. So it's not actually related to this at all. This is just vendor trash. Well, it's good to know, I suppose. Well, that's not this side. No, that's right. That's right. That's right. That's the, that's the technique, not the item. You're totally right, Dylan. Dylan, in. that's right. So let me look up the item and see if it's actually used in anything, right? Because this bundle of needles, which might be different. Okay, so let me type that in. So Final Fantasy 12 bundle of needles. And this does not autocomplete. Maybe I'm the only one to look this up. Maybe everyone just thinks it's just vendor trash and throws it away. Let's see. Final Fantasy Wiki. Okay. Guide. Sell or keep. The bundle of needles is a loot item needed to create the Huntsman's Crossbow. Okay. Well, we don't have anyone who can use a crossbow, so it's actually just vendor trash for us, but it is used in crafting. 
as is the case with most of these loot items. I just don't know where we can craft things, but we apparently can craft. It's kind of a weird thing for a Huntsman Crossbow to need as a bundle of needles, but okay. So not actually needed for us. So we can totally sell this now. It's only worth 92, so it's not that big of a deal, but if we needed to make a crossbow, this would be how it would do. Great. Bye. Um, and it's probably true for all of these. Like, if we knew, like, what the recipe was for all of this, I would totally get that, too. I don't think we need the money right now, though. Let's just not sell anything more. Let's just do that. All right, you want the fairy to go. Okay. And the bizarre items, the game keeps track to whatever you sell. Once you sold the proper item, it shows up in the bizarre. Oh, okay. So we just... We can just go ahead and sell stuff, then. Okay, so we can just go ahead and just chuck all our vendor trash in here. Well, not the teleport stone, obviously. But then that turns into a bizarre item. Okay. A lot of nonsense in here. We do just... It would be nice just to see, like, you know... If we can get to, like, 100k, that'd be great. So, that's probably not going to be today. To be fair, we've kind of been in low-level areas. Only reason is save an item when multiple recipes use the same item, so you save those and sell at the same time. Okay. Well, we didn't unlock a bizarre item. Oh, but maybe we... Okay. Crossbow and equiver bolts. That's not the hunter's crossbow, that's the ranger's, though. Okay, we don't have anybody who can use a ranger or use any kind of crossbow, so whatever. Okay, so we're not going to worry about too much about it. Okay, but that's the craft you just... Okay, you save them and then sell them at the same time, and that makes the item in the bazaar. I just thought it was like, as you, once you were just certain, like, money threshold or something, I didn't realize it was keeping track of the things you sold at the time. I don't remember us... I don't remember them ever telling us that. Maybe I missed it, though. There should be a cartographer in here, I would hope. I don't see a Moolin cartographer here. Uh, Hello. Nebra is one of the greatest rivers in Damascus. She carries strange gifts for those with eyes to look. Discarded trinkets, lost coin purses, even messages and bottles I found on my daily walks to her bank. I totally remember talking to you before. We have been here. Oh, hello. You are a cartographer. Huzzah. Map is a must. Isn't it, though? Isn't it, though? Yes. Esther Sam. Map. Great. Okay, map area of the area is complete, so now I can look at this, and there we go. That's what I wanted. Okay, we could take the bar on passage. We don't really need to, do we? We need to just go to Nubbino Fortress. I don't remember anyone explaining the bazaar. Yeah, see, that's... Sometimes the game just doesn't tutorialize. For, like, valuable stuff like that. Like, you think it would tell you something. Okay, so we want to loop around. We could go to East and go to Barheim Passage. I don't know what that would do to us. Look at the world map. I mean, either way goes to Nobino Fortress. Does it matter how we get there? I, I would guess no, but it might be like a high level area. Worth trying, I suppose. We can just head to the east and see what happens. You know, beat up some wolves along the way. Yeah. Okay, so east, follow the wall. Oh, there's a cool looking thing over there. Oh, hello, little crabs. Wow, they just drop. Oh, can we maybe. Maybe we can't go this way anymore? No, we totally can. Oh, it's totally a dungeon, though. Alright, this looks potentially dangerous. Oh, you need the Barheim key? Okay. So we can't go in there yet. That's the most unfortunate, but not totally unexpected. We don't know what the hell the Barheim key is yet. Simpsons, by the time you need to start saving, you've figured out the system. The saving until a specific time actually only saves you from farming multiple items. Right, and probably... 
Yeah, and it's just they don't tell you, like, this isn't just loot. It should be, like, crafty items or something. I don't know. It's just specified. Um, that seems to indicate you can go to the Barheim Passage from here. Let's try going east here. I'm confused. I mean, it could be, it'd be funny if the Barheim key was in both places, but that would be weird. But the game's been a little bit weird anyway, so what the hell, we'll try it out. At the very least, it'll be nice and explored. That looks like the same deal though, right? That looks like the same kind of locked off region. It is not red. Well, it's it's blocked off. It's totally blocked off. Isn't this where we actually came through here, Shifty Seek? Oh, she just caved in with a crash, and the boss is still inside. There's another entrance to Barham around here somewhere, but the boss has the key. <laughs> the boss has the key to the place he's inside of. Okay, well, we must have to wrap around the other side, right? We go to, like... Yeah, we go to the fortress. We can come back this way. Roll thumb if it sells for over 1,000 for one item to keep it. Unless I accrue more than 10 of the item. Oh, yeah? Okay, no, I can see that. I'd see that, because if you get more than 10, it be, must be easy to get. Whereas if you get less than 10, it might be rare and you might need it. No, I get that. And it's not like we have like a weight limit or anything, right? So that's actually not a bad rule of thumb. That's that's a pretty good idea. So if we get more than 10 of an item, chuck it. Yeah. Like at this point, we probably don't need the gill anyway. Right. Yeah, okay, I mean, we have almost 100k gill. I mean, if we actually like get into trouble and we need like you know, the best armor ever and it's only available in this one shop, yeah, sell everything yeah. you can, but I think for the most part, we're probably okay. And we might be at the point of the game, oh hey, loot, where, um, where we probably don't want to be buying too many things from the shop anyway. Chances are we'll be finding most of the loot we acquire. I don't know if that's actually gonna be here or not, but that's usually how the, it's usually how most RPGs go, right? At some point, you just stop buying from the, uh, from the stores. Yeah. Oop. The, the wolf hit me. It, it cost me zero. Okay, so we want to go to Nobina Fortress. We want to go this way to do so. This way? Yeah, this way. Okay. Boop. <laughs> ah, you got booped. Boop. Boop him again. Boop him again. Boop. All right. Now, Bino Fortress. This way. Um, all right, there's a Moogle. Oh, you're a, you want Chocobo for sale. All right, I don't care about Chocobos. Uh, we should probably save the game here. Okay, so. Hey, shopkeeper, what's up? We're trying money to buy my daughter medicine. Please buy something. Well, that's just a... Oh, does everyone have a sob story? Is that just how this goes? You have crap, by the way. This is garbage, and you should feel bad. These are all the garbage. I mean, high potion, sure, but no. 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 I'm not going to buy anything from you. Your daughter can die for all I care. No, that's, that's rude. That's rude. That's rude. That's just not worth it. Okay, so... The beast is supposed to be in this middle section, but this is a town. You tell me there's just a beast wandering around in town? Okay, hold on. Let's look at the, let's look at the clan primer here. Nope, clan primer, clan primer. There we go. Trouble in the hills. The burrow in Albino Fortress. Yeah, that's what it says. Oh, the petitioners in, okay, the petitioners here. That's different. Okay, no, wait, hold on. What's his name? Probably a lot of guys in here. Oh, his name is Burrow, not in the burrow. He's his name is just Burrow. All right, let's find the dude named Burrow. Ah, uh, eventually. Oh, I suppose we might have a cutscene here. This is supposed to be where we're on our way to where we need to go. Looks like an imperial stronghold.
Looks like somebody went to a lot of trouble modeling this, but um, doesn't look real somehow. Can't become this game, it's a city. Well, it's a fortress, but it's a city inside of a fortress. I was really expecting somebody to be talking, but sure. Hello. Come to help to fortify the fortress? You shouldn't have it too bad. They saved the easy job for the humes. Me, I get sent off to do the heavy lifting. Those Imperials think the rest of us should be used as tools. Nothing more. Nice, huh? Alright. He's apparently a little... Little... Mean. I don't know. Something. Nestled as it is on the border of Nebradia and Dalmasia. Now, Bina's always been bustling with, bustling with trade between the two. Bitter, thank you, Delanin. I'm just... Words not working today. These days, it's more fortress in town. This is still here, though. Our home in Abydos was wiped from the land, leaving naught but a necro hall of fiends behind. Necro hall, that's a great word. I was not familiar with that word until just now. Necro hall, that's great. Mysterious magic. Okay, do you have any cool, cool magics? We've been kind of lacking. We've got nothing. I bought all of these. Come on, give me the good stuff, buddy. Give me the good stuff. Stuff you got in the secret, I don't know, passage behind you or something. I don't know. A lot of Imperials buy keepsakes here before heading home. The Vera crafts are particularly popular. Of course, the seek in the back makes them. Oh, so they're totally fake Vera? <laughs> That's hilarious. Uh, your name's not Burrow, but, you know, we'll get there eventually. Say, you know, the Bakumi? A violent, greedy lot of them. I hear they made the Nebras Deadlands their territory. That Deathland is a fitting place for that elk. Dude, racist much? Holy fuck. A troublesome techniques may be good. What do you got? What do you got? You got crap. That's what you got. You got garbage. Go away. Your name Burrow? Your name's not Burrow. You're Burrow? You're Burrow. Hey, Burrow. Well, well. You're the boy I get that fused down in the passage. Oh, dude. I wasn't expecting him to come back in a while. That was like back when we were in prison. Come bump my bill for the Atmos? At Automus, you got our caravan stopped cold. Can't lay in any of the goods my customers want, and that's death in my trade. That's why I want you to hunt it and kill it. Yeah, sure. Why not? That's why I'm here. That's what I wanted to hear. Get you the details and get out there and hunt. Maybe you know, maybe you don't. But just a while back, the Imperials cordoned off the highway leading up to the Mosforian High Waste. See, they was out capturing as many Slavon Wilders as they could get their hands on. Army wanted them for some reason or another. <laughs> Well, their hunt's over now, but it sent this Automos on to a rampage, seeing as how they get on well with the Slavin Wilders. And who suffers? The caravans. The Imperials are the ones to blame, but pointing fingers don't solve problems. Kill this Automos before things get out of hand, boy. Alright. Alright. Automos it is. Okay, so if we look at the Clan Primer, tell us exactly where this is. <laughs> um, I can't help but notice that I don't have a map of this region. <laughs> so, um, it's in the most foreign highway, so we don't know where that is. Should tell you exactly where it is. It does. It's just, you know, a map that says here be dragons. Okay. Well, um, shit. Uh, if I look at the map here. Okay, most foreign highways to the north. Okay, we just, we just backtrack. The shops have been such garbage. I, I'm kind of tempted to go to the shops to the, to the north here. Yeah, fuck it. We'll do it. I think it's garbage. Oh, we'll actually, talk to the Gambit guy first. You any good? You any good? You garbage too? I think he's garbage too. All these are gray, buddy. I already have all of these. These shops are actually just trash. I'm gonna look. I'm gonna look. I want better armor, and I think the only way to get that. Talk to this Joker here. Do you have anything good? I oh, don't know. Antiqued armors doesn't sound very good. What do you got? You got garbage, crap, garbage, more crap. How you look? Garbage and crap. Wow. 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 No. 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 
Okay, armor. I mean, weapons, rather. Are you any good? Weapons of war? I mean, that's a little better. The bizarre goods are now available somehow. Uh, nope. Crap. Garbage. Total dreck. And there we go. All right. Well, that was fun. Forgotten Grimoire, though. Okay, fuck it. Uh, 22,000? Are you insane? I'm halfway tempted. I'm a little tempted, if only because it must be worth it. They wouldn't charge 22k if it was just complete garbage. 22,000, though. No, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. It sounds like a sounds like a ripoff. Sounds like a scam. Okay, what else do we got? We got nothing. We got nothing to do here. We can go up to the freaking fortress. That's probably a bad idea. Okay, let's just go. Go to the waste. Waste time. Let's go. Oh, Delnian, do you know if it's worth it? I mean, just give me a yes or no. Is it worth it? Because if it's not, that's great. It is? Okay. That's, that's all I need. That's all I need. I'm going to go buy it then. I mean, if you're doing that for the lols, I mean, that's also going to be hilarious. So let's do it. Here we go. Yep, yep. Care for a weapon or two. Go to the bazaar. And Forgotten Grimoire. Do it. Obtain the Scholar's Monograph. Okay. I don't know what that means. Scholar's Monograph. I'm guessing that's a... Oh, gives you an item that allows for more rare drops from certain species. Oh. That's actually kind of cool. So it's not loot. It's got to be... Or it's not an item either, I guess. Yeah, no scholar's monograph in here. Is it like an accessory? I just we got the ghillie boots. Moon to oil. Okay. So it's just... It's funny it's not telling me what this does. A key item? Position of this text enables the acquisition of superior loot from constructs. Okay. We fight constructs in dungeons usually, but that's still pretty cool. Okay, cool. That's actually, that might make up for the money we just spent, right? That might make it so that if we get superior loot, we will then be able to sell that loot for a better price, and we'll get 22k back in no time at all. It's permanent now? Great. That's fantastic. Passive items, I love passive items. Passive busters are the best. Something I don't have to worry about actually applying is fantastic. So let's save the game. Now that we've done that... We've gotten the hunt. Now we're good. Also, for better armor and weapons for mobs. Also good. That's great. Talk to you really quick. Most foreign highways just a ways down this road. Make your way across the highways and you'll come out in the Salika Wood. I'm quite fond of the star fruits you can find down there. Now the blockade is down. I'm hoping our dare's caravan will bring some down. Okay. So, into the waste. What could possibly go wrong? Pets in here too? Yep. Well, kind of. Doesn't look very high, but it might be a waste. Okay, so what are these guys? What level are these dudes? We do not know. I need to cast Libra on myself again. Okay, so what do we got? Level 30. Alright, a little worry for some, but not too bad. Yeah, we should be able to handle ourselves here, I think. What I should probably do is set up a gambit so that Vaughn just does that automatically. Uh, yeah, we're not using any of these right now. Not gonna worry about poison. So let's turn this on, let's say, on yourself. Ask Libra. And that just means we should do it every time it's not, uh, anytime it's not active. Yeah, he's not going to keep casting it. Okay, good. All right, let's fight. Let's see what's going on here. You're fine from most 5 to 10 levels higher? Yeah, that's, that's what it seems like. Yeah, we just took care of those guys. No problems. 
He's got a weird little symbol on him. Oh, don't blow yourselves up, guys. Damn, thin needle traps. Boop. All right, great. Maybe there's treasure over here. I mean, Ash will be able to take care of us for the most part. Just prefer if you didn't have to. Okay, so we... Okay, so here's the waste. We just don't know where we need to go. We need to get a Moogle Cartographer is what we need. So we just got to explore everywhere. Dude there. I mean, the trouble is mostly going to be, you know, we're going to explode. It's going to happen. Let's not... Let's try not to explode if we can avoid it. This guy over here, does he appear to be guarding something? Kind of has that impression, but there's nothing here. What are you? You are a Slavenwilder. We could fight you, but why? I mean, you're just you're just trying to live your best life. I'm not gonna bother you. Back down over this way. Let's see where this goes. Oh, this all wraps around. Oh, oh, but it's two separate entrances. All right, we'll go this way. What the hell? Um, fuck it. I'll stand in it. I'll blow up. That wasn't that bad. Wizard Bane, maybe, but. I mean, Vaughn's only kind of sort of a black mage. Ha! I mean, that is in. He barely casts any spells at all. Okay, great. Treasure. Echo orbs are not bad. We have Ash for that type of thing. Yeah. Okay, you guys are fine. Whatever. Boop. You're dead. Let's see. Okay, any chance if I go to the clan primer now? Get an idea? Nope. I'm going down. Okay, it's way fucking north, basically. Alright. Alright. We just head basically just straight up north as much as we possibly can. I mean, it would seem like since it's raining and these guys are fire. Or I don't know if that is fire, actually. Maybe he's just angry. Could be what he is. Yeah. So far, so good. I mean, for dungeon area, this seems pretty. Oh, it's berserk. Okay. Uh, yeah. Keep on heading north. Keep on northy. That looks like that could be a village. Yeah, just remnants. Okay, there's chocobos. Actually, it is a village. Crossing the mountain boy, take care. A great sloven wilder, an Atomos, has been seen raging up ahead just before the Selika wood. It's a real nuisance. We got an order to fill from Burrow and Albina, and we can't get there. Nadir's Caver Caravan. Our motto is what you want when you want it. Doesn't do to keep customer waiting. Okay, cool. You're a spirited one to walk these mountain roads, boy. Misplaced your airship, perhaps? Ha ha ha. About the only ones traveling on foot these days are those without two coins rubbed together. Died in the wool travelers, or else. But I don't mean to pry, and I won't. Go in Arcadia? You want to cross the mountains to the north, then go east of the forest. Okay, we'll get there eventually. Okay, what about you, buddy? You a good shop? Is there sending anything you need? You let me know. Alright, what do you got? What do you got? Got a bastard sword. What's well, better for. Better for Bosch? And the Kiku Ichimanchi is actually really good for you. Okay, great. I will take both of those things. Okay, go ahead and equip. There you go. Uh, take the Bastard Sword as well. So what the hell? Any upgrade is good upgrades. There you go. Goku Pole. Nice. I will definitely take that. 10k is a little expensive, but fuck it. Do it. I can probably sell the old stuff, too. That's a worse bow for you. A Chaos Mace. Sounds cool. Plus 16. Yeah, do it. Golden Staff. Platinum Sword. Okay, so now we're back to the regular crap, apparently. Yeah, we're good. We sell all the other garbage here. Get some more money back. We sell the Ashura. It's only a plus one now. 
Yeah, we're not going to be able to use the regular ninja sword, right? We can only get ninja swords two and three. We can't get one. Yeah, just, just chuck it. It's sad, but there you go. All right, what else you got? What else you got? Got a metal jerkin, which only Vaughn can use. Diamond. Dragon shield, um, which would be good for Penelo if we could actually get her to use it. Okay, we're already using... That's right, we're all pirates now. I forgot about that. Okay, well, it's a small upgrade, but it's still pretty good. I'm going to use up pretty much all of my cash to do this. But it's probably worth it. It's probably worth it. And Bosch, let's just admit it right here. He needs the help. There we go. Alright. And I guess we'll do these two, and that's probably going to be it. I don't think we can do much else. We're going to be running out of cash pretty quick here. I guess we could sell some vendor trash, but we're not going to have too much. Yeah, I need to get everyone else to let proper licenses for these, otherwise they're going to be pirates forever. I mean, there's nothing wrong with being a pirate. Just saying. They're going to be pirates forever. Okay, I'm breaking your rule, Dillinian. I'm not up to 10 for these. <laughs> Although I don't, I don't need the cash yet, right? Right. I've already bought the things I want. Let's try to keep to the rule. If I get more than ten of these, I will sell. Otherwise, let's let's keep going. Well, now you going to the capital? It's a long way. Let's get what you need now. You regret it later. And we'll talk about that later, bud. Okay. So that's right. Only if this all for one k each. Right, that's right. That's right. That's right. Save here. Oh, you want to see the magic tab? Oh, that's right. I didn't look at the magic tab. You're right. You're right. Let me look at that real quick. Hey, bud. Okay. Oh. Hey. Okay, time magic. All allies of range invisible. And good black magic. What else you got? That's all he's got, but it's two things I don't have. That's going to take me real close to all my money right there. Okay, let me go ahead and sell then. Let me sell this garbage. Not that I have very much of this. But it should make it so I can afford easily rather than just be at the edge. Of course, the teleport stone we don't sell. And I'm not using these emotes is the thing, so I should probably... I mean, I... Oh, I just have one wine. I thought I had more than that. Like, some of these are going to be really good, right? Like, the elixir is really good. Double the max HP could be really good. Under all eyes, invisible... Eh. Ether is going to be really good... I should just use the modes more often. Oh, right. I have some armor in here I'm not using, so... Yeah, sell that. Right, because Vaughn just traded up his armor, right? And then Boss traded up his armor, so that's the Bone Helm's gone. Okay, that's a little better. Now we got a Bizarre Good. What do we get? Arrows of Light. Sure. Maybe that's better for front. Might not be, but we can see. Fire arrows and a longbow. Hold on. I know we haven't bought the spells yet. We're gonna do. I'm gonna see if Fron's better off with these or not. Uh, nope. That is obviously worse. Like, way worse. And the fire arrows, I mean, basically just what element do you want to use? Lightning or fire? Okay, well, we'll be able to trade out for her at some point then. I'm not going to worry too much about it right now. But the bow we can sell. Here we go. Alright, let's buy those spells. There we go. 
All right, we're still good. We're still good. We have our accessories here that I would like more of, probably. Half damage against ice. Half damage against air. I mean to confuse and I mean to petrify. Which nobody can use right now because we don't have accessories 17 on anybody. All right, well, can't do anything there, but hey, we got some spells. And that's cool. All right. That is quite the little venue here. Okay, so I think we just still need to go north. That's verified, like in the plant primer. Yeah, but we're closer. We're closer. It's There's got to be a cartographer in here somewhere, right? There's got to be. Got to look for the Moogle. Where's our... I mean, not all cartographers are Moogles, but... It seems to be what happens around here. Is they're all... Oh, maybe... No? Is this treasure here, maybe? Trying to the south wind. Or southeast wind. Rain sense. That's all we got. I mean, that was a pretty cool vendor. That worked out very nicely. And there's a Shrine of the South Wind. Also has a strange scent. Okay. Probably some kind of clue here that we need to pick up on later. Oh, here we go. Damn straight I want to buy a map. There we go. Location map complete. Huzzah. Guess what? I saw a giant bomb deep in the Salika Wood, Kupo. That's not far off the Nibiru's Deadlands. It probably came from there. Head down towards Arcadia. Don't get bogged down in Nabidos, Capo. Dangerous place, that. All right, then. Good to know. But okay, great. We got a map. Which means now if I look at the planet primer, I'll be able to see exactly which route to take. Yep, there we go. There we go. Oh, we'll just straight north then. That's easy. We can do that. Okay, straight north. Let's go. Oh, hey, treasure. Like treasure. Thieves' cuffs. Basically, just arrest yourself. That's probably not what that does. What do you think it does? Like, steal automatically? That'd be great if that's what it did. I don't think that's what it does. Let's find out. Enables the theft of superior... Oh, that could be good. Accessories 8, you say. Accessories 8, you say. Well, let's just go and look at our licenses here. Accessories 8. There we go. I can do that right now. What the hell? And then I go to equip it. And I just have to remember to steal, which I'm bad at, but I will try to remember. But that could actually, like, make... Most of our expenses worth it here. Oh, there's spider. Or no, you're not a spider. You're totally a snake and not a spider at all. I did not steal from him though. Okay, let's try stealing from this guy. Though the chances are we're gonna knock this guy out pretty quick. Steal from the python. Okay, I mean, wind magistrate's not much, but I guess we could probably just do a gambit for stealing thing is, he'll do that, like, all the damn time. Okay, these guys here are annoying. It's going to be tough to get to. Deal from a vulture. What do we got? Yeah, wooden magic sight, sure. Yeah. I can't see very well. Yeah, silence him. Why not? What does that do? Oh. Come on, treasure. Treasure. Okay, Phoenix down. Great. Bop them all. Kill the vulture. Kill the vulture. There you go. You got him. Did this guy just respawn on top of us? Just shoot him. There we go. Ash has got the right idea. Now don't. It's the treasure. Dress the treasure right there. There we go. More ghillie boosts. We're more immune to oil if we want to be. All I need to do is go north. All I want from the world. Uh, did anybody want to shoot him? You know, we have Libra, right? We actually know... Okay, this guy's weak to Earth. Do I have anything to throw at him here? I can't help but notice I don't have any Earth. None of these are Earth spells. So much for that. 
I guess they can't conjure a stone and throw it at him. That's okay. We just beat him up. That works out just as well. Let's see. And over treasure. There we go. To make it less annoying, it takes two gamuts. First gamut is two plus foes attack. Second gamut is 100% steal. Multi foes has to be first. The foe flying to cast spell. Okay, so. Well, let me see if I can get this right. So for Vaughn. I mean, I've been shutting off most of these because it's just bad for me. But let's go ahead and turn these on now. So. For two plus foes, attacks. So let's do that. So. Over here. There we go. Two plus foes present. We'll just attack. There we go. And then for this one, we'll say... Steal. So that's basically just anybody. So we can just say any foe. And steal's probably over here. There we go. I'm going to drag these down a little bit. I want him to cast Libra on himself. Well, probably right about there. Of course, they're never going to do anything else then. I can shut these off. All right. I mean, we can turn these on, I guess. As a black mage, it would be nice to do more damage. We don't care about this right now, though. Let's see if this works. Trying to hit the uh, trap, guys. Thank you. Okay, so this is where the big bad's supposed to be. It's supposed to be right in the middle of that area, right there. Oh, we got whatever. What are these? Umaba. Okay, level 32. Shouldn't be too bad. He's gonna steal first, and then he attacks. Okay, that worked. He stole first, and then he attacked. I'm totally okay with that, even if he just steals once. And hey, look at that. He just stole another teleport stone. That's actually not too bad. That actually worked out. Okay, that's not a shrine I can activate, apparently. Okay, so our big bad guy... Oh, there he is. That's got to be him. That's got to be him over there. Okay, we have to take out these guys over here first. Don't trigger off the other guy there. No, he's just gonna steal now, isn't he? The other guys can take care of it, but I am kind of worried. Uh, let's see. Yeah, take these guys out first. Oh, he's 100%. Oh, foe 100%. You're right. You're right. That makes sense. Oh, don't go chase. Okay. Okay. He's just gonna run then, I guess. We killed the vulture, but now we have the big guy. Yep, here's the Automos. Okay, you know what? Let's just miss this guy. Let's just try to finish him off real quick. That's right. These guys are immune to Libra. Monster always immune to Libra. Apparently, that's what that little icon up the top says. Okay, so Automos, here we go. Let's just attack everything everywhere. Hopefully we get to recharge. Maybe. Yeah, there we go. Mischarge. Mischarge. There we go. Hopefully it just takes this guy out. Or for the boss. Yeah, that was like two episodes ago. I gotta go over that. How about some of this? Yeah, and we're done. Alright. Well, that was fun. I guess I should have shuffled to see if I got any other options there. Alright, burn him down. What do we got? He die? Oh, he's, he got he got hurt. He got hurt. Okay, you've gotta stop stealing right here. Okay, so. 
And on Vaughn, we will say not just foe any, but you said change the foe to 100%, which does make sense. So he does not do it all the time. There. Okay. I don't even want to fight here, Vaughn. Oh, is he not? Why is he not attacking? I mean, I could tell him to attack, but I'd rather not have to. Okay, you know what? Just turn these on just in case. Like, some reason that's not working. Yeah. There we go. All right. He's just kicking ah. ash. <laughs> okay, there we go. Hunt done. That's almost not so bad. Not so bad. So we need to go turn this in again. Good job using Kira there without me telling you to. You go all the way back over to the fortress now. We could teleport to, but it seems like it'd be a waste of a stone. Wait a minute, am I going the right direction? I'm going the wrong way. I'm going the wrong way. I have treasure. What the hell? Where's the scale? PA. So I need to go. I need to go south now because I went north the entire way here. I need to go south. And more freaking vultures. Yeah, sure. Grab a bundle of feathers. Why not? Nice. Okay, thank you, Delaney. I was looking for a good way for us to constantly steal, and I was not finding a good set of gambits. That was it. That's all it took. Thank you. I appreciate that greatly. That is a huge load off my mind, and also a good way for us to get some gill. Nice, easy way for us to steal things now. Probably should set up the same thing on anybody else who has steel. Like, that would be good for Fraun and probably Balthier. Both those guys have steel. Um, Bosh, you want to hit this guy so Fraun doesn't feel like he's a steal all the time? Great, thank you. And that's really what it comes down to. Like, Vaughn can't. Uh... Oh, nice. Level up. Vaughn can't be the only damage dealer. What happened to us here? Why are we red? Why are we red? I can't move. We must be immobilized? Oh, we're berserk. We're both berserk. Okay, we just gotta wait for that to run out, I think. Uh. Osh, since you're not Berserk, can you help us, please? I don't know if he can do anything. Uh, deal fire damage, render us invisible, make us Berserk. We're confused. Now I think I just gotta make Bosch the leader here, I think. Alright, well, Bosch, buddy, you're the leader now. Yep, they're just gonna follow now. Alright, great. Means Ash won't be healing, but that's just how it goes. Yeah. Yep, okay, they'll just fight. Okay. We need to keep on going south. Yeah. It also means that they're gonna ignore there we go. The berserk's over. And I'm probably gonna set off the trap again. Uh, maybe? I did not set up the trap. Huzzah! Okay, so now we're in town again. Uh, we can tell... Oh, how many teleport stones do we have? It's probably not worth it. Right? It's not worth it. Because the, the fortress is, like, really close by, right? It's, like, two screens. Not even that. Yeah, like two screens over. That's totally not even worth teleporting for. It was like six. I'd say sure. Two? Come on. I can totally walk two screens. Not to mention, like, you know, we'll be able to pick up more LP just by getting up some bad guys here. I mean, it's like one LP each because these guys aren't hunt targets. I think it's only hunt targets to get more than one LP. I think everything else is just one, right? I guess bosses, too. Hey there, big guys. Boop. Good steal. Good steal. 
I wonder if we actually have enough gambits. Oh, we still don't have enough on Balthier. I'm just wondering if we don't have enough gambits for Fraun. To be able to actually do the steal. Actually, did she have steal? I thought she did. Okay, don't explode. Oh, Ash. You had to go explode, didn't she, Ash? Was it was it Vaughn or Ash who did that? Okay, you go away. Just don't explode. That's all I want. Just don't explode. Did you get the treasure? I was going to get the treasure. Okay, I get it later. There. Great. Treasure we get. Echo herbs. Yeah, oh, oh, hold on. There we go. I thought we really need the sand. So it's at the point where I should probably just sell like half of our items here. Okay, here we are back to the fortress. Now we go back to our leader man and say, hey, the Atomos is dead. Long live the Atomos. So he was this dude, this guy right here. Hey, buddy. Already heard from one of the caravans coming before you. Sounds like you made short work of that out of us. The caravan shouldn't have any trouble raining supplies through the mountains now. You're my, you're my thanks, boy. Hey there, Jovi. You're grinding your ear, bro. What's the hubbub about? This here boy did for that Adamus. Who said there weren't no heroes in Albania? Or Dalbina? Okay, I just snorted. <laughs> Is that something I said? Sorry, I didn't mean to keep you so long. Thanks for again for taking that out of us for me. Here's your bounty boy. You're in every gill. Got a Gaia rod. Unfortunately, we don't have anybody who can use rods. Platinum shield, though, could be good. And, of course, the gills always appreciate it. Cool. Really wish, though, that there was a bounty board in this town. But that is not the case. Ah, well, we're going to have to go back to Nelminio. We might need to teleport. All right now, though, thanks for watching. This has been Final Fantasy XII on PC Universe. Your PC Universe 2, and I'll see you guys next time.